Expert and sexual and reproductive health are coming up with effective ways to introduce family planning goals into Nigeria's family planning programming. This process will be done through the effective use of data to ensure that the country achieves its vision of providing equitable access to quality family planning for everyone by the year 2030. Health correspondent Kemi Balogun reports. Nigeria envisions a country where everyone, including adolescents, young people, populations affected by crisis, and other vulnerable populations are able to make informed choices on their sexual and reproductive health outcomes. These experts from across states and global partners are here to open up discussions on a new family planning model. This meeting on the FP Goals model will help them to agree on modalities for using it to adopt and fast-track implementation of strategies, interventions, plans and frameworks that provide the largest impact on modern contraceptive prevalence. We're here to support the government with the strategic planning process to build out a family planning program that it's based on evidence and allows specific opportunities that exist within Nigeria at both the national and the subnational level to be leveraged strategically in a way that pushes family planning forward in line with the ministry's strategy. The use of data is essential towards achieving these goals to enhance strategic, evidence-based decision-making to prioritize investments that can advance Nigeria's family planning programming results. It's really the very first time we'll be using data to reach a consensus on what interventions we need to promote with the aim of improving our modern contraceptive uh, prevalence rates. This program is very important because it's going to ensure uh, the building of capacity and we're going to be able to use this data to take strategic decisions about the future. We've been looking at various interventions we have been working on, uh, be selecting which of them we want to prioritize and of course we'll be basing our decisions on data. Between 15 and 40 Nigerian women and girls who want access to family planning services do not have it. The model, if properly applied, has the potential to positively impact ongoing implementation of interventions to scale up delivery and the use of quality and affordable family planning services and commodities, and also the realization of the FP target of a modern contraceptive prevalence rate of 27% by the year 2030. Kemi Balogun, TVC News, Abu.